you know, for the community. We just wonder why someone would do that to us. A couple breaks into a community center in Northwest Portland, and it's all caught on camera. This is Coin 6 News at 10 o'clock. I'm Jeff Giannola. And I'm Jennifer Hoff. And that pair spent more than two hours over the weekend scavenging the whole place. Now, Belina Jones live there tonight. And Belina, the footage gives us a pretty good look at these two. Now that video gives an up close and personal look at that couple who Portland police are now looking for. The community center says tonight they think the couple was on a date. They came in and it seemed like they were using like their cell phones to just kind of scope the place out. Tim Kristen knows just how hard it is to try to get into the doors of the Linton Community Center. Then he uses a screwdriver to get inside the mechanism. The center that is home of a preschool before and after school programs and partnership with the Oregon Food Bank is kept under high surveillance. But security video from over the weekend shows a couple breaking in. She was wearing his hat and she was like, oh, you know, this is so cute and fun. And they were both smoking their cigarettes while they were trying to do this. Kate Horan teaches at the school. She says the couple looked like they were on a date. They used a code formerly given to people in need to use spare showers to get into part of the building and then to gain more access. And then when they couldn't get in downstairs, then he went into his toolbox and he got a screwdriver and then they took apart the um, that metal thing that holds the door. You can see the man try to break in as the woman smiles and watches. When they get in, Horn says they smashed a printer, took a generator, but bypassed all their expensive electronics. You know, it's just very peculiar. Well, we are a nonprofit uh, community center. It's not that we get a lot of money. And so, you know, the money that we do go uh, get, it goes to uh, the people that we're helping for Oregon Food Bank or, or the kids. Caught on camera, Horan knows what the thieves look like. She says if they ever meet face to face, this is what she would ask. And why? You know, why would you do that to a community center when here we're trying to just help people? And why would you do that to the kids when, when you're taking things that they need? Now, while the center is thankful that the couple didn't get away with more, they say the break-in has caused a sense of fear and a place that should be a place of protection for both children and the community. Again, police are looking for those two suspects tonight. If anyone has any information, they should contact PPB. Reporting live in downtown Portland, Valina Jones, Coin 6 News. Yeah, and that video gives us a good look at their faces. Mm -hmm. Valina, thank you. Also